Hello everyone, this is Chad coming to you in the first of my series of videos talking about the Starlink Internet Service uh, satellite program. Uh, I received an email uh, back on Wednesday, November 4th, uh, just a few days ago. I uh, went to my spam inbox and I didn't realize I received it. I was cleaning out my spam and, and found the email. I signed up for the notification months ago and was hoping to be notified that I could participate in the program. Uh, didn't realize I'd been chosen. Uh, I found the email, uh, read through it, and uh, I guess right here I've got it up on my screen uh, from Starlink. And uh, just reading it, it says, as you can tell, we're trying to lower your initial expectations. Expect to see data speeds from 50 to 150 megabits a second. Latency from 20 milliseconds to 40 milliseconds over the next several months as we enhance Starlink system. There will also be brief periods of no connectivity. As we launch satellites, install more ground stations and improve our networking software, data speed, latency, and uptime will improve dramatically. For latency, we expect to achieve 16 to 19 milliseconds by summer of 2021. The Starlink phased array user terminal, which is more advanced than what's in fighter jets, plus mounting tripod and Wi-Fi router costs $499, and the monthly subscription costs $99. If that sounds good, then order here. Thanks, Starlink. Um, so I went ahead and clicked the uh, order here button. Uh, it took me to the order page. And uh, for that uh, $499, um, here's what you're supposed to get is, uh, what's I guess, what's in the box is uh, the, the satellite uh, receiver, the Starlink, you get one of those. Uh, there's three cables that come with it, uh, a mounting tripod, uh, you get, a, I guess, the power supply, of course, a carrying case, and the router. Uh, that's what you get for your $499. Um, more advanced than what's in a fighter jet is what they say. Um, then you have to pay the $99 uh, per month subscription. And I guess right out of the box, you're gonna you're gonna see uh, internet, uh, perhaps not uh, what they had promised in the in the beginning of the program, but uh, it's gonna get up and running, and then it's only gonna improve from there. As you can see on the left, I've got my order confirmed uh, screenshot up uh, for you to see. Thanks for participating in the they call it the better than nothing beta, uh, better than nothing. You will receive an email shortly. Confirming receipt of your order. Uh, I did get that. Uh, then I'll please follow the link in the email to complete your account setup. So that's something I still have to do is complete my account setup um, in there. Uh, ordered the, uh, the system today. Uh, I guess I'm assuming it'll ship here in the next day or two. Probably take, I don't know, a week or two to get to me. I don't know how long it takes um, to get all the way up here uh, in Minot. Uh, but once I have that, I'll get that installed and uh, test it. I'll share my experience with you. Uh, hopefully it's a good experience. Uh, works out okay. Gets a good internet uh, signal and um, generally reliable reliable speed. Up in Minot here, you know, we're not uh, starved for internet services. We do have a couple different uh, providers here, but you know, they're the traditional um, internet companies like your cable TV company and your telephone company. And so they're they're roughly about the same type of service. Uh, not a lot of competition there, really. Um, probably $50 a month, uh, 25 to 50 megabits uh, per second uh, that for that price. And from there it goes up if you want uh, faster service. You know, this, this system here is designed to you know, be used really anywhere in the world. And that's kind of the idea here. If you're in a very rural place uh, or uh, different countries in the world that are just underserved, um, you know, they can't get access to the this, this simple things, education and materials and and uh, things that we take for granted here uh, up in Minot. So that's kind of the idea is to give everyone in the world access to the internet at uh, yeah, kind of a reasonable uh, price. As you can see, the the satellite dish uh, is 
um, something you just mount on your roof. It's uh, probably similar in size to you know the regular cable TV satellite dish satellite uh, dish receivers that that you've seen on roofs for I don't know the last thirty or thirty years or something like that. Uh, so it's um, pretty similar to that. Uh, we'll we'll take some time and do an unboxing video when it actually arrives here uh, the next uh, short time frame but uh, going forward I, I plan to produce uh, many in the series of videos regarding the Starlink system and I, I guess I hope you'll engage with me and uh, start a conversation ask questions I'll try to answer them as best I can in the comments of course you know like the videos subscribe become a subscriber uh, that's what's going to feed, uh, you know, feed the channel um, growth and uh, continue going forward. So I uh, hope to see you in the near future. Thanks.